Hey everyone, it's Tim Holtz and I'm here at Creativation 2020 in the Ranger booth, right? What better way to show you what's new from Tim Holtz and Ranger than taking you firsthand and showing you these new products. So of course we have 15 new colors of alcohol ink. Now alcohol ink was initially released with Ranger in 2004 and the product line has come a long way, but these 15 new colors are so vibrant, so intense. You can see we've got bold pinks, a really deep red like rosewood, We've got some bright and deep oranges, we have that Dijon, which is a greenish yellow, some new greens. Down here, we even have a new teal, some bright blues, light blues, deep blues, all the way into violet. And the great thing about alcohol ink, they are for non-porous surfaces. So you can use them on Yupo, glossy cardstock, sparkle cardstock, metal, glass, plastic. But the colors, wow, take a look at this palette now. You can see how these new colors really add to the existing line. We've got our new pinks like Gumball and Fiesta, but they really correspond well with Flamingo, Raspberry, Wild Plum. Look at this rosewood, this deep red. What I love about using alcohol ink is that you get such a unique look, color, and texture from these because this is just blown around with a little bit of air to create all of those colorful layers. And speaking of that, our new tool, the alcohol ink air blower. This is just a bulb that is designed to be squeezed that's just going to burst air and that's going to allow you to move your inks around. Of course, you can use them with things other than alcohol ink. It's just air so you can move around your watercolor, distress, anything like that. But if you haven't tried using air with your alcohol ink, it gives it an entirely different flow across your surface. Another new product are the alcohol ink alloys. Now these alloys are a leafing metallic it's a metallic ink that is designed to work with alcohol inks or blending solution. It gives you a very, very rich metallic, look at that, I love that. See, you can tell people just love to touch it because these leafing metallics are really impressive because when you apply them to a surface, when you use them with inks, they're actually going to break down and create these little clumps of really intense metallic. Now, these metallics are slightly different than a mixative. A mixative is designed to mix in with your alcohol inks, but of course you can use your alloys, your mixatives, your alcohol pearls with your inks. Now, let me talk about substrates because when it comes to working with alcohol ink, there's a whole variety of ways to use them, whether you're doing some really cool uh, abstract paintings, whether we're working with cards, or if you are in fact an artist and you can pick this up with a brush and paint photos, having different surfaces to use your inks on well, that's what Ranger's all about. So you can see here that in the alcohol ink world, we have everything from gloss cardstock, Yupo white, translucent Yupo that's kind of like a vellum, heavier Yupo. We also have black matte. Now, if you use black matte with alcohol ink, you need to use a snow cap mixative, something white so that color pops through. We have foil tape, brush metallic, which is kind of a dulled metallic that still shows the color, but it's not nearly as reflective as a metallic. Silver Sparkle, one of my favorites because it looks glittery, but it's really a printed sparkle on there. So it works perfect with alcohol inks. And then Hardcore Art Panels. These are wood panels laminated with a vinyl on both sides. So it's perfect for adding your alcohol inks to create paintings, work of art, abstract. And this is our new shape, these hexagons. So if you're one of those mixed media artists that want to create several different art panels, you can create that and kind of put that together. And to me, it's what I love about working Ranger is that they have the ability to really bring unique products to the market. Now one thing I'll tell you about alcohol inks, if you haven't used them before, you can really use any colors of alcohol inks together, right? You don't have to stick with any specific color palette or any theory, but I will tell you this, that if you like to paint with them, we not only have the alcohol inks available open stock, but we also have them in spectrum kits. So you can build your collection up by your reds, oranges and yellows, greens, teal and blue, or violet. So you have a lot of different options with the new alcoholing products from Ranger.